June Haven's chats up her charming seatmate on a flight out of Kansas, but she doesn't realize that she will soon land in the middle of an international adventure. The fellow passenger, Roy Miller, is a covert operative who claims he has been set up to take a fall. Today we are going to talk about a 2010 American action comedy film called, Night and Day. Returning home to Boston from buying car parts in Wichita, June Havens collides with Roy Miller at the airport twice and is bumped to a later flight CIA agent John Fitzgerald, believing June is working with Roy, puts her back on the plane. While June is in the plane's restroom, Roy subdues the passengers and flight crew, all agents sent by Fitzgerald and Crash lands the plane in a cornfield. He drugs the shocked June, warning that agents will come after her. Waking at home, June prepares for her sister April's wedding and learns she wants to sell their father's 1966 Pontiac GTO Tri-Power, which June had planned to restore as a wedding gift. June is picked up by Fitzgerald and his agents. Roy appears, killing numerous agents in a highway chase and rescuing June. She flees to her ex-boyfriend Rodney, a firefighter before Roy arrives and pretends to take June hostage. Roy persuades June that she is safer with him, and reveals that he is in possession of the Zephyr, a perpetual energy battery. He had been assigned to guard its inventor, Simon Feck, until Fitzgerald tried to steal the battery, framing Roy. In Brooklyn, June and Roy discover Feck has gone into hiding but left Roy a clue that he is in the Alps. They are attacked by henchmen sent by Spanish arms dealer Antonio Quintana. Drugged again, June drifts in and out of consciousness as they are captured and then escape to Roy's off the grid island. Accepting a call from her sister, June accidentally leads Quintana's men to the hideaway. Escaping Quintana's unmanned aerial assault vehicle in a helicopter, Roy knocks June out to circumvent her fear of flying. June wakes up aboard a train in Austria, where Roy has reunited with Simon and they manage to kill Bernard, an assassin hired by Quintana. After checking into a hotel in Salzburg, June follows Roy to a meeting with Naomi, Quintana's henchwoman, where he offers to sell the Zephyr. Fitzgerald and CIA director Isabel George finds June and reveals that Roy used her at the airport to smuggle the Zephyr past security. Heartbroken, June leads the CIA to the hotel. Fleeing across the rooftops, Roy was shot and falls into the river with the Zephyr. Simon is kidnapped from CIA custody by Fitzgerald, the real traitor, to be delivered to Quintana in Spain. Returning home, June attends her sister's wedding and visits an address Roy had been monitoring, where she meets his parents and learns his real name is Matthew Knight. They believe their son, an army sergeant and Eagle Scout, was killed in action, and have won various lotteries and sweepstakes they do not remember entering. Leaving a message on her own answering machine declaring that she has the Zephyr, June is taken by Quintana's men to Sevilla. Drugged with the prototype truth serum, June explains that Roy's deal with Quintana was meant to alert the CIA so June would be returned home safely in time for the wedding. Roy, tracking Fitzgerald, rescues June, and leads Quintana and his men on a car chase. Quintana is killed by a bull stampede, and Roy trades to Fitzgerald the Zephyr for Simon. Fitzgerald shoots Simon anyway, but Roy takes the bullet instead. Simon reveals that the battery is unstable, and it explodes, killing Fitzgerald. Roy is hospitalized in Washington, D.C., where George tells him June has moved on and welcomes him back to the CIA. However, George's coded language, as Roy explained to June earlier, reveals that he will be killed. June, disguised as a nurse, drugs Roy and breaks him out of the hospital. Waking up in June's rebuilt GTO, Roy and June drive toward Cape Horn, and the movie ends with Roy's parents unexpectedly receive their own tickets to Cape Horn. Thank you for watching and listening. Consider subscribing to the channel for more action comedy movies like this. See you again soon. Until then, take care.